you just never expect those words to come out of someone's mouth if you have cancer. Your world is just thrown upside down because you're thinking, I have so much more life to live. I have a little baby at home. Like, I want to watch her grow up. Those first few weeks before I got to Roswell were probably the worst, worst weeks of my life. It was, it was overwhelming at first, and I felt like I wasn't gonna be there. I felt like, wow, like, how much time do I have? How old is my daughter, her name is Ari. I was like, how old is Ari gonna be before I'm gone? And I remember just even like putting her down to sleep and being like, is this, like, am I gonna have to record my voice for her? You know, like, oh, it kills me, I can't even think about it. Uh, it just extremely important to be at a place that understands that it is different for a 20 or 30 year old or you know a young adult to be diagnosed with cancer and they have such a support team targeted for young people that it is it's incredible